We know the running back situation, and we know this is an opportunity for you, uh, as well as some others, but just talk about grasping that opportunity and what you hope to do with it. Most definitely. Well, uh, I just try to go out there each and every day and just improve on the things that I can improve on, you know, uh, only control the things I can control, you know, uh, just get better at the small things, get better at the things I need to work on last year, and just uh, diving into this playbook more and just learning more about uh, a professional football team and just offense and just everything, you know, learning behind uh, Drew Brees and all this stuff. Uh, I'm, I'm just going out there each and every day just trying to improve myself. Yeah. You're an undrafted kid last year. How do you co compartmentalize and not let this get too big for you when you look at the, the opportunity, then you know what this offense is capable of? Most definitely. Uh, I just go out there and play. You know, uh, we're all here for some of, for whatever reason. You know, we all have different paths. But uh, at the end of the day, we're all here right now. And uh, we all put on our uniforms and get dressed the same way. So uh, I just go out there and play and do what I've been doing for 15 years plus. You know, that, that's all I know how to do. So like I said, man, just diving into this playbook more and just finding tunes on the things that I need to work on in my game and just going out there having fun. You, you you don't make it this far without talent. What do you bring to this team? What do you what do you add? Well, I, I like to think I add a little bit of uh, size and speed to the backfield. You know, I think I have a, a combination of both. You know, and uh, just just willing to help this team in any way I can. You know, you're also a guy who excels on special teams. Yes, sir. How how much do you look forward to that part of the game? Ah man, every bit of it. Last year. Uh, there were some guys on the sideline. We couldn't wait to get out there. You know, we would compete as far as who would get this tackle, who would get the most tackles in the game, or who would get the most stops. So just things like that, uh, it, it made us hungry, you know, and I think in the end it made us a better group uh, collectively. So I think when you get a lot of guys like that, you know, on one team, it just brings a lot of positive energy and positive vibes. And uh, in the end, the team is more successful. Yeah, I know you'd rather be working at running back, but if you are doing, you know, primarily special teams or a lot of special teams. How about the new kickoff rules changes? How do they affect how you go about your job there? Yeah, well, to be honest, I, I wouldn't I wouldn't say I'd rather be a running back. You know, I'd just rather be wherever I can get on the field the quickest at. You know, that's that's my primary uh, goal, just getting on the field the quickest, wherever the coaches see fit that. But as far as the new rule, uh, you know, it's the game of football. It's changing. Uh, it's, uh, it's a lot of things is changing, you know, uh, for, for good reasons, though, as far as health and stuff like that. So, uh, you know, you just got to just roll with the punches and adapt because it's always going to change and things are never going to be the same. So uh, you just got to revolutionize with the game.